All right, this is my review of the uh, lighter, the oil lighter from Deal Extreme. Uh, I think it's appropriate. I'm wearing my Trogdor shirt because if you remember uh, Strong Bad using a Zippo lighter in this cartoon, if you know the reference. Uh, so I like these oil lighters. I see people walking around with Zippos. I'm like, oh, I want that. But they're like $20. This is $3.71. Uh, it seems to look and feel and work just like a uh, original Zippo. It says on the back Earth, and it shows a planet. I don't, I don't know. It's from Hong Kong, so uh, you know, just another knockoff. Uh, so yeah, when you get it, it comes in dry. So uh, if you know, you pull this out from here, and you lift up this little tab with a screwdriver, or you can even use the the little thing on here, if you don't have anything else, it will get some on it, but it's not really a big deal. Uh, you just you just buy this right here at like I got this at Walmart for a dollar eighty. Don't buy the Zippo brand fluid. Uh, it's like four dollars more. And uh, if you didn't buy a Zippo brand lighter, I don't imagine you're going to be buying name brand uh, lighter fluid. But yeah, even if you have a Zippo brand lighter, just buy this stuff. Uh, so you just pull this tab up, and uh, I'll do that for you right now. And you see this cotton under there, and uh, you just tilt that in there. And then what I do is tilt this back so you don't make a mess. Don't like try to squip, squirt it in there or something. You'll make a mess. And if you overfill it, it's not really a big deal. But uh, if, well, it's a big deal if you really overfill it. It goes down the sides. Then you're gonna light it. And it's gonna go everywhere. So you're gonna want to wipe it off if you get too much in there. Um, the damp pad is fine. One problem I have with this lighter is, uh, if you know, uh, this goes back in here, this other way. Uh, one problem I had was when I would close it, it was like coming out. I don't know why. I don't know if that's a standard problem or whatever. I've never had a regular Zippo, but what I did to fix this was I squeezed this and made it tighter. So if you buy one of these, you're having that problem. Squeeze the case, and as you can see, no more issue. And it was also not sealing properly. It was leaving. It looked horrible. So now it seals perfectly. Um, so I'll light it here. Oops. So when you first put some fluid in it, I don't know what it is. It has to like light. I've never actually owned one of these, but this thing's great. Uh, one thing that's really cool. Well, for one, like it's pretty good with wind um, I mean it's not a butane windproof lighter as you can see I'm moving it around yeah it's uh, it's okay um, but what's really cool about it is I didn't really think about this but it, it's much better than like a, a regular lighter because you can just set it down and yeah I don't know what it's about I just think it's cool it's like a portable candle um, so yeah, three bucks. And this is under two bucks. So for under five dollars, you can get yourself set up with a reusable lighter rather than continuing to buy those uh, disposable ones. So yeah, that's all I have to say. I'll leave the link in the description for where I bought this, and you can get your own. Uh, thanks for watching.